Hello again, everyone. No-tilling your corn and soybeans is a simple concept. You plant your crop directly into where the previous year's crop was without the use of any tillage tools. Now, being a practitioner of it does have its challenges, though. The Martin Farms of Mount Pulaski have been seeing the advantages since the early 80s. Doug and his father, Jeff, know all sides of the practice. The, the short-term changes, you know, you see the reduced trips across the field. You see the reduced uh, erosion and runoff. Um, Long-term changes are the buildup of organic matter and, and uh, things that might take a generation to see a big difference in. But uh, short-term changes, you know, uh, labor savings, fuel savings, and the main thing is erosion and trying to help reduce, you know, some of the runoff and some of the things that uh, are raising a concern for a lot of people in the country. Now, it is estimated that of the eight major U.S. crops, 36% are no-till. Now, the Martin see a growing trend towards no-till, partly because of possible future regulations of runoff of crop nutrients into water streams. They recently were recognized by the Environmental Protection Agency and by the National Association of Conservation Districts as a hero of agriculture because of their commitment to conservation. And that's one of the things, you know, we try to portray an image that we are proactive among some of the things that are going on and showing people that we're trying to do things the right way. And, and we are concerned because, you know, this is our, our living, your living. I mean, this is, this is our our lifestyle and we want to preserve it just more than more than anybody. You think you're doing the right thing and it's nice to be recognized as far as that goes. We've done a little work with them on, on writing an article and, and getting that published and and then learning this past week they've been they put us on their their website as a hero of agriculture was it was a nice honor and we're take a little bit of pride in that. Now the Martins were one of five farmers that were recognized nationally as agriculture heroes. Farmers working towards making a difference. Now, they have appeared in many national articles and have been presenters on their practices at several workshops. Congratulations to the Martin family of Mount Pulaski. This is Agribusiness Today, brought to you by Baum, Chevrolet, Buick, and Clinton, and by John Deere. I'm David Brown. Agribusiness Today is sponsored by...